Hey, Game Guardians, Claudel Triple XV here, and welcome back to Destiny Glitches. In today's video, guys, I'll be covering a really old glitch from early in year one of Destiny. That is glitching into the Cerberus V3 boss room where you fight Valus to Ark. Credit for this can't really go to anyone, it is so damn old. It's hard to determine who found it first, but yeah. Want to give a shout out to the last video's SF Bounty winner, and that was Adam Gothier. Wanted me to wear Pet Revenge mask, I'm doing so. And of course, guys, there is another SF Bounty in this video. So if you do find it, leave it in the comment section down below. And if you're first, you'll get a shout out in the next video, and you get to choose which mask I wear. So without further ado, let's get up and let's get on with this. Now, guys, you want to be on patrol? You want to come to the Valley of the Kings. You want to come right down here to where the Cabal land tank is. You want to run underneath and get out of map. Everyone knows this. It's been here since the bloody beginning. Now from here you just want to jump up on top of these rooms here and one thing that not a lot of people or not everyone knows, you can simply jump up onto these little uh, gun turrets. It's pretty cool. Some of your friends are probably wondering how the hell you get up on top of these uh, guns. Well that's how you do it. Pretty simple. But I just thought I'd throw that in there as it was on the way. Now to actually get into the Cerberus V3 boss room where you fight Valus to Ark, if you go in that direction you will end up hitting the checkpoint and you'll be stuck outside. So you want to come along this side here. And you just want to jump up to this doorway. And there you go, you're inside Cerberus V3. Inside you can run right into where Valus to Ark where he would appear. It's pretty cool. And one of my friends like knew about this like pretty much what the first, second, third day of Destiny, Jewboy 300 he knew about that, DJ knew about it. So as I said, can't really give credit because because even they don't know if they were the first people to find it. Uh, but yeah, a little shout out to those two guys nonetheless. Now while we're in here, what can you do? Well you can't really do much, you can run around, you can explore. And that is the aim of the game for all glitchers. Exploration. That's what we love doing. And obviously if you guys are watching this, that's what you like doing as well. But anyway, now on to the main event. Which is showing you guys how you can get inside that room right there. The room at which Valus to Ark actually spawns from. I remember I showed this to a few of my buddies, I showed it to Mystic Outlaw, I shown it to Jewboy300, and now I'm going to show it to you guys. So here we go. So I am using my Titan, and if you're going to use your Titan, make sure you've got agility up high with increased height. You can also do it with your Hunter. Warlocks will have, will have a problem, but if anyone can do it, it'll be Man Doggy. He's the man. Anyway, you want to play the strike, guys. You can do it on patrol, of course, but it's more interesting on the strike. Play the strike till you get here. And while your friends, while your buddies, while your teammates that are playing the strike are taking care of the enemies, you can just simply go ahead and glitch in here. Now, of course, we're not going to glitch right inside the room because there's no point. It's the strike. It's going to be open. So we're going to stay outside the map. And I am going to pop some heavy ammo just in case I need it. I'll probably need it for one swipe. And now we want to make our way to the very end of this room here. So if you guys have always wondered how does, how does Valist Arc spawn, stuff like that, that's what you guys are going to see, and uh, it's pretty cool. So we're at the end here, there is two little things there, as you can see. Just want to drop down, you can land here, as a little safe spot first, drop off, Twilight Garrison hover, sword swipe, and there we go. We're inside the room that Valist Arc is going to spawn into. Now all I had to do, I actually had to wait like two minutes while I was recording this video, waiting for the, the guys out there, these uh, randoms to actually kill the enemies. But there we go guys, the door is opening. Ooh, what's going to happen? Of course Valis is going to appear, but how does he appear? He just simply appears like that. He runs out, trying to attack him, I can throw grenades and stuff through it though, as you can see. 
And he almost obliterated me. But yeah guys, that is that. That's how you glitch into Cerberus V3. That is how you can glitch into the room where Valus to Arc spawns. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, a comment, or even subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, Guardians, this is Cloydel XXXV, and as always, thanks for watching.